Hey guys, Blockit here, playing some 1v1 Joust against Kronos, which is gonna suck. Oh, he hasn't loaded in. Uh, uh, it's gonna... <laughs> I'm hitting them, like, why is it an upgrade? I'm like, oh. But it's gonna suck pretty bad. Oh, well, I, no, I'm not gonna be pessimistic. But I don't have high hopes. <laughs> I don't have high hopes for this at all. Alright, uh, stock up on consumables first, because Coronas is high sustained because of his two. So we don't want to get out sustained. And sell one mana potion. Second tier boots are going to be more helpful than a one less mana potion. Hopefully, watch. He'll be getting away, and then they will be on cooldown. We'll have three charges on it, but I'll be out of mana. Oh well. Mm. Oh, by the way, uh, this is. Um, okay, never. Uh, this is probably going to be a backup video, and the only thing that means is that the version of Smite you see m in this video may, may not be the current one. So just keep that in mind. All right, let's see what we can do. Yeah, we'll just clear the lane a little bit faster. Mm -hmm. If we can uh, out push him right here, that would be delightful. Okay. Well, basically, oh, if we could hit him, we might have a shaboop. There we go. Nice, not bad, not bad. Got an early kill on him. I like that. <laughs> I like that a lot. Okay. Do that. Mm -hmm. Charge these guys. I'm just trying to put a wave in the tower so he loses some gold. Alright, and I'll, uh, I'll get the heck out of there. Oh, that was good. Uh, I have won against Kronos's and 1v1 Chaps before with Zeus, but not often. Uh, shoot. I think it's, Kronos is a tough guy to fight against, so I'm going to go straight into Void Stone just to help a little bit. Um, He's pretty annoying to fight against, to be honest. Because just when you think you've bursted him down with your ultimate, he'll just use his too. And granted, I mean, he can misuse his ultimate. But it's like a... That's something that rarely happens. That's not... That's not something that generally happens, you know. That he's using... He'll use his ultimate at the wrong time. That's not something that Kronos generally do, because... They'll generally see that, well, okay, I need to get out of here pretty quickly. And it won't have a huge amount of effect on him, no matter what. Uh, you know, it, it can still happen. <laughs> Gotta use my detonate charges to clear away. Uh huh. Maybe you will form more. Oh. Uh huh. <sighs> so close. Uh, taking more damage than I would like. Taking a lot more damage than I would like. However, he is running out of mana, which that's good. Uh, if he's low enough on mana, we can, uh, we'll, let, we'll let him push, and I think we can use our alt to take him out. Uh, nah, he's running like a chicken. Okay, that works too. I will be happy to deprive you of gold and farm. Totally valid option. Alright, he's going Vampiric Shroud for the sustain. That, that makes sense. Okay, yeah, there we go. Mm hmm Uh, let's see. I'll probably go back after this. Yeah, I'll push the tower. Ah, oh, shoot! Out of there. <laughs> yeah, and I'll pop back. Pop back. <laughs> Not try to ping to when I'm the only one there. Alright, uh, after this, we'll probably get Doom Orb. Uh, just because we want to start snowballing, because Chrono snowballs hard. And we want to try to avoid that. We really want to try to avoid that. So we'll go Doom Warp into Polynomicon. Uh, maybe into... T you know, I probably should have got the Telkine's Ring over Voidstone. I just thought of that. Uh, it's not an item I generally buy, because... Generally early game... Generally early game, I just go for like the very basic starter items. <laughs> nice. There we go. Mm, yeah. I guess I... He's hitting me with his uh, time rift, rift a lot. That's really hurting me. Uh, honestly, if he just dived, he could probably kill us right now. Okay. We'll get that going. We'll get this going. Uh-huh. Come on. Oh. Oh, come on. Of course, he uses that just as we go for him. Oh, well. 
So alright, we'll grab Doom Orb. Only 2,000 gold. Very powerful snowballing item. So alright, we're just about as strong as he is. Um, hmm. We're not really into like the super farm carry stage yet. But we gotta be careful. Because until I get Paul Nocon, I don't have his tower pushing potential. So it's gonna be tricky. Alright, snag the gold from those guys. Because if the tower hits me, don't get gold. So you want to go for the people that the tower hasn't hit yet? At least, that's just how I do it, I don't know. Alright, may not win this one. This is my first match today too, so it's kind of... Fighting an uphill battle already going against Kronos. Probably the best 1v1 god in the game. Now don't get me wrong, Zeus is a strong 1v1 god, but... No one can really compare to Kronos, just because he's got sustain... He's got crazy sustain on his 2, he's got crazy attack speed and movement, and... The most frustrating thing about him, you just, uh, I mean, there's just no r way really to counter him. There's not really any items that counter movement speed. I mean, grand, there's witch stone and stuff, but they're all physical based. Okay, seeing it. I think of Zeus. He's not that good of a choice for solo lane, just because of you know, he's got kind of bad wave clear. Uh, yeah. Just because he's got kind of bad wave clear. And... Kronos definitely has better wave clear. But we'll see what we can do. Uh, his ultimate is back up. It's got a... Probably just a 90 second cooldown right now, I think. Uh, that can theoretically get better. Yep, Archer's dead. Okay. Maybe? Come on, one more. One second. Oh! Oh! Why? Why, baby? <sighs> um, I'll go for Doom Orb. I'll just try to sit back and farm. That's just going to be my only strategy. Um, Because buying Doom Orb, generally, if I'm dying like this, you actually don't want to do that. But the way is, I think I can pull off. I just got to play very cautiously, very conservatively. Just farm up. Because honestly, I, I would have killed him there if I had been a little, left, a little less antsy. So I'll, I'll be very careful, I'll keep things on cooldown. Uh, my ult is a great zoning tactic. Uh, basically, you know, if he starts bum-rushing me, I can just put my ult on top of myself and use that to be pretty safe, no matter what. Okay. Ooh, come on. Aw. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just gonna stay back and farm. If we can pr pick up Enfeebling Curse, that would be great. It's a good counter to Kronos, because when he gets in and like, starts trying to mash you up really well, you can just activate Enfeebling Curse and do a pretty high amount of damage. Oh, I missed him. Dang it, there goes my wave clear. Do a pretty high amount of damage to him, just in general. Um, oh, just by slowing him down and reducing his attack speed, it's pretty powerful. Uh-huh. Sucker. See, we're doing the damage to him, but he's doing damage to us too. Really wish I had a health potion. I thought about buying one, but I ended up not. And the most, probably the most frustrating thing that we're talking about here is that, you know, you see, like he's at 70 percent health. At any time, he can hit. He can just hit. No, he can just hit four and be pretty darn safe against just about everything we can throw at him. Okay, take that out. Uh, he's play, play, playing pretty safely, too. Um, I mean, he's not, like, really bum-rushing me or anything, which he he probably could, to be honest, but... Glad he's waiting. Really glad he's waiting, actually. Alright, we'll see if that arcs to him. It doesn't. Oh, well. I'll do this. If we can out-push him... Yeah, I, I'm really just trying to get the farm up on my Doom Orb. Like, let's see... 140 to 188. Really feeling that power. Uh, yeah, I... Oh, if he's staying, I'm staying. I got no problem, stay. Oh, I thought he had Doom Orb for a second. I'm like, crap. This is a lot better on him than it is on me. Oh, I can't, I can't keep missing that. Because he can clear definitely pretty easily just with his basic attacks. Just because of, you know... Okay, good, that got out. Just because of how he works. Well, he bought Telkine's ring, so his basic attacks, they are especially strong early game. Uh, what? How do you only get one charge on my head? Oh, I didn't have Aegis up. Oh, well. 
Oh, it's back by Enfeebling Curse. Uh, cause I really want to get Paul Noble Kong going just so I can really start dealing damage to him. But I gotta wait. And honestly, I'm gonna pl play very safely, cause if I die, I'm gonna lose a lot of magical power. So I'm gonna play it safe, gotta be careful. And I'm just gonna have to farm up. And then once I'm full powerful, once I'm, you know, 100% good, I'll just take him out. And we'll take out the. T we should be able to take out the tower pretty quickly. Uh, once we get Paul Nomicon going, that won't take long at all. It, I'm playing really safely against I because I just Chronos can do incre such incredible amounts of damage if you let him do it. All right, that'll take him out. And I am going to try to get him now. Eh, I'll take that. That was a fair amount of damage. I'll just blow this uh, mana potion just to do that. Uh huh. Got one on him. Make it two. Nah, it doesn't look like it. That's the thing. You hit him with one, and then they get real cautious. All right, we'll clear that wave. Like it's. Uh, I. That's the thing. It's not really anything that clears quickly. <laughs> like I don't know what you call it. So we'll do that. Uh, just to take away a little bit more of his health. Uh, we do have a slight amount of CDR, but I'm not really feeling it. If you know what I mean. Okay, we'll do that. Okay, and that's a th really hard to take down Kronos. Just because he does just have that alt ready to go. You can go back to. Well, actually, we're willing. We're willing him down pretty hard. Uh. <laughs> okay. Uh, blue and feebling uh, curse, but we're doing pretty good. I don't pop his ultimate. And <laughs> that will be back at around the 12 <laughs> I missed, sucker. That's gonna be back around the 12 minute mark. Oh, we're gonna buy a teleport just cause I really wanna capitalize on that. <clears throat> Let's see. Ah, uh, he went back too, dang it. There we go. Now we got Polly. I'm a lot, I'm a lot more secure in my damage. Not even in my damage, I'm just a lot more secure in general. Alright, so 315 to 300, because he bought a Rada to Hoodie. That's going to grab him a very big chunk of magical power that's not dependent on whether or not he dies. That's good for him, but not so good for us. Because now if we... <laughs> it would be good if it was opposite. Okay. Really, It would be really cool like if he had minions or something. Uh, I'll just use my charge here, just do a little bit of damage to him at least. Uh-huh. Okay. That's not bad. There we go. See, now we're doing some damage. Now... Honestly. I'm pretty confident that... Three... Two... One. If he comes out a little... Okay, he's running back to back. I'm like... Oh, shoot. I'm not gonna have time to do anything. I guess I'll grab damage buff real quick. See now, <laughs> that's the thing. Paul Nomicon is just so darned it good, so delicious. Okay, there we go. We'll grab damage buff just for a nice effect. Uh huh. Popular items. After this, I'll grab the hoodie too. That's gonna boost my magical power a lot, like a lot, a lot. Uh, I don't know where he is. Oh, he's there. You know, a lot of people buy Magi's, uh, Magi's blessing against Zeus. And I'm not sure why. I mean. Unless that stun is really killing you, I'm not entirely sure why you would do it. Oh, missed that auto attack. That would have been great. Okay, got Aegis leveled up, just cause, like, if he's a... What the? You guys saw that too, right? <laughs> Alright. We'll do that. Ooh, he actually hit me with that. Oh, cause I was shooting. Well, not... Shooting is not the right word for it, but... Alright, I think I'm going to clear this way from... I'm going to go home right now. <laughs> Maybe. I'll clear this wave. I'm really tempted just to pop my alt. Just to get him out of there. Alright. Wave's pretty close to cleared. He's got like one freaking archer. That's going to die in like two hits. Take that any day. Right, we'll pick that up. Get some extra MP5. We'll heal up. Playing super safe against this guy. 
It's a little annoying. I'm really just kind of waiting to kill him. Kind of surprised. Wow, I give. Oh, okay. Wow, that gives a lot of CC reduction. Like 40%. That's. That's way more than any other item, I think. Oh, you thought you were coming in here? Mm hmm. Oh, sucker. Okay, good news. Alt down. Bad news. Maybe gonna die. Oh, are you serious? That went up just as you. We would have had him. Is he going for us? No. Alright, we'll buy this. Okay, on our way back. Oh, shoot. <laughs> this is bad. For starters, we already took how much damage? Come on! Oh! That was so close. That was so close. Uh, I don't think we were even all the way healed when we left the base. Okay, we'll just clear that super quick. Oh, again, get Aegis. Not Aegis, get Paul Nomicon. Just do this for no reason, just because Paul Nomicon is so good. Keep hitting it. Don't need to keep hitting. Don't need to keep doing that. I'm going to go home. And I'm going to get Rada to Hootie. And that's going to make our... Like, we're at 390. He's at 300. And... 550. 340. He bought... Did I Oh, he bought Chronos' pen. <laughs> That's a kind of funny that we both bought at the same pen. Alright. Not sure what else to get. I mean, I could get Shell. I don't know. I've never used Shell. I guess I could get, like, Kevinly Agility or something. Alright. Boop, boop. Now, it all comes down, down to who's ballsy enough to just 1v1 it. I want to be really cautious. If I lose that... Ah, actually, Doom Worm's not going to do too much, but it's going to suck. I mean, it would... It would suck. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Got him with that. Got him with that. Eh, we'll hit it. <laughs> I'll take that. It was just, uh, we probably should have activated Aegis and tried to chase him a little bit. That hit me hard. That hit him harder. Alright, we'll just do that. Okay, his alt's down. Okay. We're gonna wait two seconds. Oh, come on. Aha, but we got him. That's the thing. If his rewind goes down, he basically has no defense. So you just gotta wait for that, and you're good. You're gold. Alright, I'm not really sure what to get after this. I'm thinking about getting, like, some sort of magical penetration, like, maybe just Obsidian Shard. Uh, not for any other reason, just so then I can push the towers faster. Here, hit the tower with that. Do that. Get that. Okay, and the Phoenix is down. That's the magic of Fallen Nomicon, folks. You just gotta keep hitting that Phoenix, and it's dead. It's a really cheap move, and I feel kinda scummy about it, but... I'm not gonna do that. He's, he's looking at me the wrong way. I don't like that. Alright, we'll just go back all the way. Not all the way, but most of the way. I still don't like how close he's getting to us. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Actually, we have him. Dead. Um, oh, hey, and that's the match. That's the thing. Uh, Zeus is very strong in his own right, but I'm just really nervous playing against Kronos, but... Hey, I got the two... I got the most... <laughs> Sorry about that. I got the most snowball-y item in the game. Doom War, one of the most snowball -y, at least. I got Rata to Hootie, just tons and tons of magical power. <coughs> Sorry about that. Little sneezy. Good game. Honestly, I've beaten... I've won more times against Kronos than I've lost, so that's a little telling. This guy was like a rank 6 Kronos. BGG. I don't know what that means. Does he, does he mean bad game? Does he mean good game? I don't know. I think he's just going to say it's okay. So, alright, that was actually a pretty decent match. I'm glad I won, won against a Kronos, which is pretty good. But, man, I was acting so tentatively. All right, but, I mean, people don't understand. When you're playing 1v1 Joust SMH, get Doom Orb. Doom Physical, get Heartseeker. 
They're the highest things in the game, and they're cheap, and you can get them early on. They're, you buy them to snowball. I mean, I think this is wrong, because... No, yeah, this is... This magical power is lower than in game, remember? It was like 600 or something. I was... I had like 150 magic power on top of it, man. It just goes to show how much building can help. Just how important builds are. I mean, I, if you have a good build, you're going to... Uh, it's just so important. But, alright, uh... Hope you guys enjoyed. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, subscribe, anything to show your appreciation. And I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.